VBS On The Go Forecast. I'm meteorologist Erica Cato. Well, we're going to start the day off with temperatures in the upper 60s thanks to that onshore flow. But as we head into your Monday afternoon, we'll bring us mid 80s by lunchtime, upper 90s by your afternoon highs. So, all in all, temperatures are where they should be for this time of year. But we're certainly going to heat things up as we head into Tuesday and Wednesday. So, future cast shows the bigger weather story still contending with some monsoonal moisture, bringing isolated showers and gusty winds to the northern Sierra. But high pressure is going to retrograde back. It's going to strengthen, and it's actually going to really bump up those temperatures as we head into about midweek. So all in all, onshore flow will still keep the coast cool. But take a look at these numbers for the valley. Looks like Wednesday shaping up to be the hottest day of the week. National Weather Service has that excessive heat watch Tuesday through Thursday, and then temperatures will climb back down as we head into the weekend. And that is your CBS On The Go forecast. And welcome to your on-the-go news report. I'm CBS 13's Curtis Ming. And I'm Sharon Roger. Six Flags celebrating 30 years of Shark Week. It's now underway at Discovery Kingdom in Vallejo, where experts say sharks aren't the ravenous predators people actually think. Because a lot of the footage that you see is of them eating because it's really exciting to see them eat. But the truth is, they are cold-blooded. They actually don't eat very much at all. The park is hosting several events to raise awareness for endangered shark species. And snails slug it out. 150 snails put on a damp cloth in a race to an outer circle. The World Snail Racing Championships dates back to the 60s in the UK. The winner gets a treat stuffed with lettuce leaves. Delicious. The record dates back to 1995 when a snail named Archie, remember good old Archie? He traveled 13 inches mm. in 2 minutes and 20 seconds. For more local stories and the latest on developing stories, just visit our website, cbs13.com. Thanks so much for watching. Safe travels. Have a beautiful day.